12 Things You Didn't Know About Apple Welcome everyone, to the place where everyone get inspired. Good morning, we hope you're having an incredible day so far. In this video we take a look at some of the less known facts about the most profitable company in the world. Apple Incorporated. The company is on track to become the first trillion dollar company, but there were a lot of things you might have missed on, mostly because the company isn't proud of or simply didn't get that much coverage, compared to the shiny products they sell. Now let's take a look at 12 things you might not know about Apple. Number 1. Apple actually had three founders. We all know that Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak put together the first Apple computer in the garage of was his parents' home in Cupertino, California. But, you know, there was a third guy working along with them, Ronald Wayne, a friend of Jobs for when they both work at Atari, and he agreed to help start Apple with him. Not only did he help develop the computer he wrote its manual, and even came up with Apple's first logo. When he realized Apple might not make it he sold his shares to Steve's for $800, a real bad move that share would be worth something like $40 billion. Now, Wayne now sells stamps and coins in the Nevada trailer park. Number 2. Apple was started with a calculator to start the company jobs, sold his VW microbus, and was sold as calculator. That might sound pretty one-sided now, but the fact is that the scientific calculator was worth more than the van back then was managed to sell it for $500, that's around $2,000 in today's money number 3. Steve Jobs is the son of a Syrian immigrant. Few people know that Steve Jobs was adopted even fewer know that his father was Abdul Fadijandi, a Syrian immigrant that got Joanne Shrivel pregnant in college, due to parental issues the baby was put up for adoption, and although the mother insisted the baby be adopted by educated people, young Steve was adopted by Paul Jobs and a high school dropout, and Clara Jobs, who hadn't finished college John Dolly who manages in Nevada Casino, never met his son, but the two did exchange free emails, just before Jobs died. Number 4. In 1986, Apple started a clothing line, you might have never heard of it, because the project failed completely. They called it the Apple Collection. And the idea is far from the modern sleek minimalist and timeless design, that makes Apple products the sensation they are today. It's hard to picture a turtleneck Steve wearing a tracksuit in rainbow-colored Apple logo. Number 5. Apple owns the patent for the slide to unlock feature. Apple is currently suing Samsung claiming patent infringement over this. A judge has already overturned Apple's patent claims to slide to unlock in Germany. Number 6. Apple's iPad's Retina display is actually manufactured by Samsung. Apple found out that outsourcing their Retina display to Samsung is actually cheaper than creating the infrastructure to build it themselves. Also it's an incredibly lucrative contract that gives Apple slight leverage with Samsung. Number 7. Steve Jobs invented the computer mouse by stealing it from Xerox back in the early computer years, in order to click on something you had to insert rows of code that would tell the cursor where on a grid it should go and what action you wanted it to perform. While visiting Xerox's research center he noticed a three-button mouse that would have been perfect for his Apple interface. The only problem is that it costed $300, so he had the team drop one of the buttons and the cost down to $15. Number 8. Jonathan Ive has worn the same t-shirt in every Apple product intro video since 2000. Same as Steve Apple's lead designer wears the same type of clothing, and all official releases. They come in lovely dad shades of earth tones, and they're made by a company called G-Star. Number 9. The Mac battery is bulletproof. In case of horrific events the battery inside your MacBook could potentially save your life as it was made to be bulletproof. Number 10. Bill Gates stole Windows from Apple. In a similar fashion, how Mark Zuckerberg sold a Facebook idea from the Winklevoss twins. Steve Jobs passed Bill Gates with creating an operating system for Apple. After developing the product, Bill saw its standalone potential and decided to never deliver it and started selling Windows on his own. Number 11. Steve Jobs forced Microsoft to save Apple aid in 1997. Apple was running out of cash, their legal battles with Microsoft were going on for so long and costing them a ton of money. So Steve offered Bill Gates the possibility of a settlement of $150 million for non-voting shares at Apple. Microsoft promised to support Microsoft Office for the Mac for five years, while Apple agreed to make Internet Explorer. The default web browser on the Mac, but not the only one. Number 12. The most expensive iPhone in the world costs $48.5 million. Falcon Supernova iPhone 6 Pink Diamond. 
The most expensive mobile phone is the world had costed its owner as much as $48.5 million. The device is made up of 24 karat gold and is studded with a huge pink diamond on the back. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.